Propelling business development through technology is a theme for the 14th annual St. Lucia Taiwan Partnership Trade Show scheduled for November 26 to 27, 2021. Minister for Commerce, Manufacturing, Business Development, Cooperatives and Consumer Affairs, Honorable Emma Hippolyte, alongside her team from the Commerce Ministry, met with Taiwanese Ambassador, His Excellency Peter Shen, and his delegation to advance planning efforts for this year's trade show. The trade show aims to heighten awareness of ICT business solutions while showcasing unique products and services from Taiwanese and St. Lucian micro, small and medium enterprises to a local and international audience. To increase trade and business is a very important uh, job for my embassy uh, for, and also to enhance the relationship between Taiwan and St. Lucia. And as you know, Taiwan is uh, uh, a trade uh, country. We export a lot of our products. So that's also one of our mandate to uh, export to, uh, to help our company to export their products. But uh, also we try to uh, increase the awareness of uh, Taiwan is about uh, what good products are in St. Lucia and to enhance uh, mutual, uh, the interaction or exchange between uh, two, uh, the business between two, uh, two countries. Honorable Hippolyte noted that the Ministry of Commerce will assist all St. Lucian businesses to improve the standard and quality of their products and services to be export ready and to build their competitiveness. We must get businesses going. It is when the business uh, matures and makes profit, we need to employ people. And the long and short of it is every St. Lucian wants a decent job, that they can get an income, and that they can feed their families. That is a summary of what all of us want. And we can only do this when we have a Ministry of Commerce supporting the business community, talking to them, removing and helping them remove the challenges that they have, and helping them get into new markets. Marketing specialist with the Ministry of Commerce, Cindy Eugene, said due to COVID-19, this year's trade show will rely heavily on the use of ICT as the platform to propel business development and to increase awareness of St. Lucian products and services. The trade show here is part of the Love St. Lucia campaign because the Love St. Lucia campaign is an emphasis to encourage persons to um, be familiar with what St. Lucia produces, encourage the use of St. Lucian goods, encourages the trade of St. Lucian goods and services. And here we look at goods and services from Taiwan. And the partnership here is to get some support from Taiwan, be it that we can trade, be it that we can see some great distribution of goods from Taiwan within the Caribbean, and we can also seek to get some manufacturing tools, some machinery to improve our processes here in St. Lucia to have more efficient products similar to what we see coming out of Taiwan. Ambassador Chen believes that the focused ICT and virtual platforms at the trade show will attract greater interest in Taiwan and other international jurisdictions. I think there's a lot of products and a lot of uh, uh, good uh, resources in uh, St. Lucia and I really encourage more people to come to St. Lucia or more people to do business or invest in St. Lucia. A memorandum of understanding will also be signed at the trade show between the Taiwan External Trade Development Council and the St. Lucia Chamber of Commerce, Industry and Agriculture. We are hoping that by signing um, the MOU, members of the two bodies would have an opportunity to start doing business-to-business -business arrangements with their counterparts in Taiwan. The 14th annual St. Lucia Taiwan Partnership Trade Show will feature 14 Taiwanese companies, 12 St. Lucian businesses, the American Chamber of Commerce in Barbados, and the DigiGov project from St. Lucia. For the National Competitiveness and Productivity Council, Glenn Simon reporting.